Orange Osceola State Attorney Monique Worrell has made one of her first major decisions since taking office. She has decided against charging a man who was shot by a deputy. The shooting late last year started with a stop for minor traffic violations. News 6's Lauren Cervantes has the details behind the decision. According to a filing yesterday by the state attorney's office called a Nole Prosequi, the state attorney has decided to drop the case against Ida Nilsson Urbina. The state attorney's office telling me today that the decision was made based on body cam video and what it didn't show. Stop running! Stop running! Stop running! Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Show your hands! Show your hands! Body cam video shows the confrontation between an Orange County deputy identified as Bruce Stolk and 18-year-old Eden Ilson Urbina. Get your hands on your waist, Dad! Yeah, he's reaching. The sheriff's office saying that Deputy Stolk shot Urbina, ultimately hitting him in the leg. All of this happening back on December 21st, according to an incident report that says this stemmed from a traffic violation. The video shows a flash, what appears to be the moment the gun was fired, and later the deputy confirming that. One shot fired, reaching his waistband, not sure if he has single zero. What can also be heard is Urbina apologizing and later screaming. But the state attorney's office says there's something the video doesn't show. Whether or not Urbina heard the lawful commands, saying that's why the case was dropped, because they could not prove beyond reasonable doubt that Urbina actually heard the commands based on the body cam video. The state attorney's office telling News 6 what also didn't help is the fact that the first part of the video is silent. In terms of Deputy Stolk, FDLE says their case involving the shooting is still active, and the Orange County Sheriff's Office says while he was on paid administrative leave for a period of time, he is now back working as a patrol deputy. The Sheriff's Office did not have a statement regarding the state attorney's office to drop the case, but Urbina's attorney, Andrew Darling, tells me that he thinks the state attorney's office made the right decision in dismissing the charge. In Orange County, I'm Lauren Cervantes, getting results, News 6.